Hello and welcome to another update video about NetGas. Um, I really only want to focus on the shorter time frame here today um, because not much happened since yesterday's video. However, we saw a little bit more downside. That's currently what we're expecting in this particular account. And that guess looks again quite weak. It um, it is a difficult market, I can tell you that. And it's been ranging now for many, many weeks. Yeah, um, We've been in this price region already in April and March. So it is getting really, really boring. Um, my view is still that we topped here most likely in a wave two. This is the bearish count. Yeah? topped in a wave two here on the 19th of May. That was around 268 here on the futures chart. Um, we are basically now in a wave three. That's the idea. And it looks like as if we completed already a wave one to the downside in wave three. It's when we bottomed here at around about 230. And then I think, and I'm going to zoom in a little bit. And again, there are surely different um, possibilities, but I've labeled then the wave two as an A, B, C structure. And that um, sort of reacted here to the 250 level, which is the 50% retracement It actually just below that. So it was not a very strong wave two. And um, yeah, we have now with today's drop actually made um, another, well, not a new low, have we? just about maybe, um, but it has broken below the wave one low. And that's additional confirmation that we are now in a third wave of a third wave. Now using the Fibonacci extensions, I can now calculate roughly a target for you for this third wave there. And that should take us ideally but I'm not sure if I trust that, ideally to the 1.618 extension, this third wave here yeah, to 188. Now I'm not sure if we really get down that much, but I think I would start to watch for possible reactions already around $2.11. That's the 100% extension, um, the one to one ratio. But yeah, ideally the wave three reaches the 1.618 extension. However, it's not like in crypto where the wave three is typically the 1.618 extension level or higher. Um, and that gas doesn't need that necessarily. It can also be a bit shorter. Um, but yeah, what else is there? What I can tell you is that as long as we stay below the 78.6 retracement level there, which is at $2.60, um, this particular assumption that this is a one, two setup and we come down lower in a wave three is valid. Surely this wave two could extend if it comes up again. Um, but as long as it stays below that 260 level, the overall focus can be on the downside. Okay, is something bullish possible? As I just said, yes. Um, but in my opinion, due to the structure here, this is highly questionable now. Um, it's of course possible, but I would have to count here the movement of the April low as a wave one and a wave two and another wave one and the wave two. There's a few problems. I don't like this structure. doesn't really fit that at the moment. Um, the structure of this possible correction. Um, in fact, it rather looks impulsive to the downside, but you know, I'm not saying it couldn't work. So a one, two, one, two setup is possible. Problem I have is that the second wave one is longer than the first wave one. And that is typically an indication that um, is just an ABC. You know? Um, but we'll see. But um, again, it, it, I would consider it as a one, two, one, two setup if price can break above 260. But again, analysis is always based on evidence. We are currently below resistance. And that's sort of um, why I focus here at least short term and track that move to the downside. Yeah. And um, what's moved down here now, you know, this price move here could have already been the wave one of the wave three, because also the wave three here that you can see on the screen would be a five wave move. So let's see if this is going to follow through for the next few days. Um, hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye bye.